So uh, Yezu 857 radio has a built-in SWR meter. Um, but it's just an indication. So I've got an analog meter here. And uh, we can see what it really says. First thing I'm going to do, I want to key up on that frequency. And as you say, it's full signal there. If you can see on the analog um, meter, it's calibrated. So we've got a desk mic here. We're going to key the radio and see what the SWR says. Right, it's hard to see, but there are three, uh, it's three dots size, so they're, you know, um, two dots side by side and then three high, which is 1.5 on the SWR meter, and I've heard that before years ago on the internet, um, someone else mentioned that three dots represented a 1.5 SWR, this is a DQ to radio. Right, four, three, five, four, three, five. Again, that's three dots high, which is one point five SWR. So the kilo radio. Now this one's flat as a pancake, I think. Kilo radio. So the radio, radio's in transmit, but no SWR. The needle don't move. Alright, so that's that. Now I have got um, a UHF channel. That's not so perfect. I just want to show you that. Um, so UHF, we're going to transmit here. If you can see that, it's four dots high. One dot, two dots side by side, and then four high. Which gives you an SWR, I'd say about 1.6 or 1.7. Um, but on this meter, when the dots come up, it does get to a point where a line comes across horizontal, and that's the one I really want to show you because that um, represents uh, a two to one SWR. So this is a VHF channel. That's not so perfect. Key up, as you can see there, you get a horizontal bar, which to me rep represents a two two to one SWR. Not so great. So this little video there on the 857 SWR meter and indication, I hope that helps anyone.